Welcome back to another episode of Ty Tries It. I just got done with the workout. I went to the park here and did some jumping practice. One-footed jumping. I haven't done any jumping in about a week and definitely felt it. I was feeling sore, tired, and was just barely tapping the rim here at Parkside Park in Boulder, which I think is 10 feet. This weekend took a break from the jumping and did a long run um, called the Boulder Skyline Traverse with a few buddies. The guys I ran with were mostly cross country runners. They're used to running really fast for short distances, 5K, 10K, mile, things like that. So they weren't used to doing a long 16, 17, 18 mile trail run in the mountains. And then I hadn't run in about six weeks since I did the Rattler 50K in Colorado Springs in late March. But I was able to keep up pretty well actually. We all, I felt like we were at about the same fitness level, which was encouraging to me, having not run in six weeks, um, that this jumping training has helped me maintain an overall level of fitness. But it made me feel like it'd be a good idea to at least get out there and do some training runs every now and then. I do feel like I've definitely regressed um, after having sort of a lazy week, taking more days off than I would have liked. I've really just been thinking a lot lately about the idea that 1% progress every day compounds over time. So going forward, I'm going to really make an attempt to be consistent and do something related to this goal every single day. It doesn't have to be going to the park and jumping, it doesn't have to be lifting, but something. Uh, whether it's a at-home workout, whether it is getting out to the park, something to move me closer to that goal. My initial goal was to be able to dunk in two months, and it's been a little over one month now, uh, one month and four days. So I'm actually really optimistic that I'll be able to hit it within that time frame. There's definitely the possibility that I could be plateauing, but if I just keep con consistently getting a little bit better and better, I really only need three or four more inches on my vert to conceivably be able to dunk off an alley -oop. So I think that by the time mid-June rolls around, that should be attainable. The question is, do I stop there or do I keep going? I have some ideas for other goals I want to try. 40 yard dash, throwing a football as far as I can, uh, fastest mile time that I can get. I think eventually I'd like to get to the point where I'm working on three to five separate goals at the same time. Maybe two or three uh, physical goals, you know, 30 pull-ups, something like that. And then a couple of non-athletic goals also. If anybody does watch these videos and has ideas for goals that I should try to work towards, leave a comment below and that would be super helpful. Also, if you have feedback on other types of videos you'd like to see, you know, more cooking videos, more how-tos, what you like, what you didn't like, any feedback would be greatly appreciated. So feel free to leave a comment. Thank you. I'm going to try to be more consistent in putting videos out, and I'll see you next time.